how to get a free domain. That's what I'm going to walk you through in today's video. Before I do that though, I want to know what is it that you're trying to build on the internet? Do you have something you need to get up online for people to be able to find and you have zero dollars to invest? Or maybe are you starting a business? You have a little bit of a budget but are trying to spend as little as possible to get your business or whatever it is up on the internet. Well, for the first option, you need a domain, a website, all of that free and free for life, not something for the short term. And then if you're starting a business, you have somewhat of a budget, but you're trying to save money. So there's a bunch of options on how you can get a domain free for the first year. And then I'll show you how to pay as little as possible for your domain going forward. At the end of the video, I'll show you where we end up purchasing our domains from. One place you may see mentioned in other YouTube videos, blog post articles, et cetera, is Freenum. So this isn't something that I would recommend. They advertise that you can get a free domain, but I haven't actually been able to get a free domain and they're not the mains that you would probably want for your website anyways. So if you put in something that you're searching for and click search, they show you .tk, .ml, .ga, .cf, and .gq as something you could potentially get for free. But when I go to click on get it now, it always says unavailable. And I go to check and there's nothing at that website. So if it's jeffreythalen.tk or the figco.cf, there's nothing at those websites, but they're not available here. So this is just something I wouldn't want to go through the whole process, have something not work out, give them all my contact information. Maybe they want your credit card number. Who knows? I would just do one of the other options I talk about later on in this video. One place you could potentially get a .com, .co, .net, a domain like that for free for a longer period of time, maybe for as long as you need your website, is if you're spending a bunch of money on other services. With Eonos, for example, if you have email with them, as long as the contract is, you get the domain paid for. So if you have no budget for anything, this isn't a great option for you. You're essentially paying for the domain, but it's kind of bundled up with the other things that you're paying for. So that option I think isn't great for you. If you have $0 to invest in the domain or the website, I would check out the free website builders. Most website builders do have a free plan. They won't give you a free, say, .com domain. They will give you a free subdomain. So a subdomain looks something like this versus a normal domain that you own. Not a huge deal if you end up going with something like this that costs you no money. Wix, for example, has a little bit longer domain for their free websites, but you can do most things you could do with the normal website with the free one. There are very few that allow you to sell products, have an e-commerce store. Other ones will strip out some functionality. One other thing to keep in mind is they will put an ad on your website. So they're not making money directly from you. And so they're hoping somebody that visits your website We'll see the ad, click on it, build their website and give them money. As an example, here's what the ads look like for Wix and Weebly. So if you do have a little bit of money to invest, but don't want to spend any more than you have to, getting your domain for free for the first year is really, really easy. Most website builders and hosting companies, for example, if you're building your website with WordPress, you're going to need hosting. They will give you a domain free for the first year. There are two things I want you to keep in mind though. The first, read the fine print. So for example, Squarespace, you can get a free domain with any of their plans but you need to pay for it annually, not monthly. So if you sign up monthly, it's not gonna include the free domain. Then somewhere like Weebly, just check which of their plans. So the free website builder or the very lowest cost plan do not include a domain, any of the plans above that will. So it's either the time frame or the specific plan you choose. Some may include or exclude the one year free of the domain. So make sure to check that. The next thing to keep in mind is the renewal price. So what you're gonna pay for a year, two, three, five, 10, 50, or as long as you have your website. So for example, with Squarespace, they charge $20 per year for a .com domain. With Wix, for example, it's going to cost you around $14 or $15 for a .com domain. The privacy protection is another, about the same, $14 or $15. Bucks. So you're paying close to $30 per year with them. So that's not the cheapest place to pay for your domain and you can transfer your domain. So they're just assuming you're going to be lazy about it. You get a free year and then you're just going to keep it there forever. If you transfer it, you can save a bunch of money. I'll tell you where in just a second. In this scenario where you're not ready to build your website yet, but you want to have the domain, you're not going to be able to get a free domain for any amount of time. There's nothing you have kind of in exchange to be able to get it for free. So you want to pay as little money as possible for that domain. I wouldn't recommend purchasing from somewhere like GoDaddy. So you see the first year here, they'll give it to you for a penny, but you have to pay for year two at the same time, which is $19.99. So you spend 20 bucks for the two years, so 10 bucks per year in that scenario. And then all the future years is gonna be 19.99. Also privacy protection, they'll charge you, they have a couple of different options of 10 or $20 per month, I forget what it is. So 
be careful of that. I have a whole video walking you through how to save money when purchasing a domain. Check that out if you want to make sure you're getting the best domain and not paying for anything that you don't need. So where we recommend purchasing a domain or if you have the first year free and want to transfer your domain for year two and beyond would be Porkbun. So with Porkbun for a .com, for example, you paid $9.73 for the first year and for all following years. Also included in the 973 is privacy protection, an SSL certificate, and free trials to a bunch of things. They do have promotions sometimes for the first year, but it's always very clear what the renewal price is with them. So to summarize, if you have a little money to invest, figure out where you want to build your website and sign up for a plan that gives you the domain for free for the first year. Before the first year is up, transfer your domain to Porkbun or somewhere much lower cost. If you want to learn how to transfer your domain, check out the video up above. If you have no money to invest, we recommend that you sign up for one of the free website builders and just use a free subdomain and you can have that open forever. If you want to learn about options for free website builders, check out the video below. Hope to see you in those and future videos. Bye. -bye.